Okay, welcome to this demonstration of um, JMRI doing a signal box demo. I'm using uh, Panel Pro and I've uh, in layout editor set up this. So I've got a, a, a British kind of signal box set up and I'm hoping that this can show you a few things about what I've managed to do with JMRI. Um, it's taken a lot of work and I'm not there yet, um, but it does show some of the capabilities. I've created some of my own icons for um, representing you know, instruments in a signal box and I'll show you these working in a moment. Um, they're not perfect. I, I'm not a bit artist, bit map artist or whatever you call it. Um, I, need, I need some help, I think, to make these look better but um, they're just a representation at the moment and then the, you know, they, they will be improved hopefully. The signal levers come with JMRI. Um, so I've just had to create these three items, <clears throat> the commutator and a push button. Um, in the British signal box, you have bell, a bell code system and uh, I'm not claiming to be a signalman. I don't know exactly if this is correct for the line I'm using. Um, all I know is it kind of is a rough representation and shows something of um, the operation of a signal box. So at the moment I've got uh, some of these levers have been pulled. Uh, we've got a train down here. This is Pont Mill. This is based on the uh, Newquay branch in Cornwall from Part and Newquay. Um, Par is down to the left, Newquay is up to the north, and this is the junction of Pont Ponce Mill, and this is the China Clay Works. So um, what we'll do is uh, set a, uh, a, well the route is already set through on the Luxolian main line, um, and we'll signal for a train coming. So I'm going to indicate, uh, first of all I want attention, so I'm going to press the button once. And we should get an acknowledgement back from Luxellian signal box. That's it. A single bell code. And I'll now signal that there's a train uh, ready. So I'll do two presses of the button. And we should get echoed back two uh, bells to acknowledge that. And that works, thankfully. I now turn my commutator to show the line is clear. And uh, indeed it is clear. And I'm now going to simulate the train passing through the section by clicking on the icons on the track, sensor icons. Um, the signal is detecting occupancy in this block here before it is cleared. And as the train passes, the signal is reset. Oh, uh, a little bit of bounce there. That's me just clicking the icon funny. Um, but it's as, as this has gone to uh, red to show occupancy, the whole of the commutator has switched to the left to show um, the train is now on the line. And as the train passes away, that's now returned to normal. And that's uh, that's how it works. Um, if I want to bring this train here out of the siding, I need to unlock the route there. I've got some sound effects missing from some of these things. I want to have sound effects on everything. <laughs> um, and I'm going to set this, pull this lever here to set the route into the Ponce Mill work sidings. And that's done that. I've not got lights or signals set up to coming out the other way at the moment. Um, and now this train here can correctly come out. There's a the catch point there which has been reset. So I'm showing the train passing out of the siding. And I'll click the wrong one there. That's the route one. And uh, passing down the line this way. and out of the picture and that's uh, that's gone so 
I can unlock that. If I don't unlock this, but I attempt to set the other route, I get a, a whole load of bells go off. That's uh, you know, just to say that I've done something wrong. And the route has not set the other way. The lock has come off, in fact. I, I'm not sh quite sure why that's happened. There's a lot of logic in this, and uh, it doesn't always behave quite as I would hope. Um, um, but anyway, it's usually my fault, although I have had some problems with a, with a partial install of Java causing sensors to do very weird things. So uh, I'm on Windows 10 and I've put Java 8 on, so uh, watch out for partial Java installs, particularly if you're on 64-bit, it can be a problem. Um, just make sure you get uh, Firefox loaded and um, install Java again and it should all be fine. It's, uh, yes, anyway, <laughs> that's a very, very short uh, explanation of something. But anyway, I'm waffling a lot. Um, I think you've seen effectively how this works. Um, I hope you've enjoyed that. Thank you for watching.